Today, I'll give brief introduction on web mining. Web is a massive, explosive, diverse, dynamic and mostly unstructured data repository which delivers an incredible amount of information. Web mining is a use of data mining technique to automatically discover and extract information from World Wide Web. Web mining is used to extract knowledge from web data. There are three areas of web mining. They are web content mining, web usage mining and web structure mining. These categories focus on knowledge discovery from web. First, we will see web content mining. As the name implies, web content mining is a process of extracting useful information from the content of the web document. It may consist of text images, audio, video or structured record such as list and tables. Web content mining involves techniques for summarization, classification and clustering of web content. It can provide useful and interesting patterns about users' needs and customer behavior. It targets knowledge discovery in which it collects information from text document, multimedia documents such as images, audio, video which are embedded or linked in a web. Web content mining techniques mines unstructured, structured, semi-structured and multimedia data. Screenscaper, Mozanda, Automation Anywhere, Web Content Extractor, Web Info Extractor or the tools used to extract essential information that one needs. Web Usage Mining Web Usage Mining is a process of identifying browsing patterns by analyzing the user's navigational behavior. Techniques for discovery and analysis of patterns can be placed in two main categories. They are pattern analysis tools and pattern discovery tools. Now we will see pattern analysis tools. Webmasters are extremely interested in questions like how are people using the site, which pages are being accessed most frequently. These questions require analysis of structure and hyperlinks as well as the content of the page. The end product of such analysis might be frequency of visits per document, most recent visits per document, how frequently each hyperlink is clicked, who is visiting which document from which location, most recent use of each hyperlink. Techniques for pattern analysis are visualization techniques, OLAP techniques, data and knowledge querying, and usability analysis. These are the techniques used for pattern analysis. Next is pattern discovery tools. Pattern discovery tools implements techniques from data mining, psychology, information theory on web traffic data collected. Before analysis, data pre-processing is done. What is data pre-processing? It filters or cleans web log files. It eliminates outliers and irrelevant items. Filtering the raw data to eliminate the irrelevant items is important for web traffic analysis. Example, embedded graphics can be filtered out from web log files whose suffix is usually in the form of GIF, 
jpeg jpg the next step is to integrate data from all sources to form a visitors profile data pattern discovery techniques some techniques are applied to discover the patterns few techniques or analysis are discussed here path analysis customer clicks on web pages are represented by graphic models graph models are most commonly used for path analysis by analyzing the path we could find that 90% of customer visits only first 3 pages of website so it is better for web webmaster to design those pages and retain the customer grouping users gets conclusion by grouping the information example might be grouping the browser techniques together grouping the location of visitors of customers grouping keywords used by the customers grouping maximum links clicked by the customers these information are used by e-commerce giants like amazon ebay flipkart and so on to improve their business next is filtering based on the customer request it filters the information it answers the question like how many clicks a particular link received for this week how many visitors visited the site from particular domain how many visitors from particular browser visited a site next is statistical analysis by analyzing the session file one can perform different kinds of statistical analysis on variables such as page views viewing time length of navigational path average view time of page and so on association rule association rule is used to relate the web pages association rule may relieve a relation between users who visited the page containing the electronic products to those who access a page about the sporting equipment this is a simple example of association rule clustering clustering is a technique to group together a set of items having similar characteristics example person who applied for credit card were in group between 25 to 30 with annual income of dollar 4200 sequential patterns sequential patterns is to find inter transaction patterns such that the presence of set of items is followed by another items based on time stamp order transaction set web log files can record the set of transaction in time sequence example 50 percentage of clients who bought computers also placed an orders on ups after 15 days next is classification classification is a technique that classifies the items that you required in two predefined classes example 50 percentage of users who placed order on heater who lived in northern part of canada web structure mining web structure mining is a tool used to extract patterns from hyperlinks in a web what is hyperlink a hyperlink is a structural component that connects web pages to different locations web structure mining is used to generate structural summary about website web page by analyzing the links based on the topology of hyperlink web structure mining will categorize the web page and generate the information such as similarity and relationship between different website web structure mining is also called link mining hits and page rank algorithm or the popular web structure mining algorithm hits algorithm hits algorithm ranks the web pages by processing in links and out links of the web pages 
in this algorithm a web page is named as authority if the web page is pointed by many hyperlinks and web page is named as hub if the web page point to various hyperlinks next is page rank algorithm page rank algorithm is the most commonly used algorithm for ranking various pages working of page rank algorithm depends upon the link structure of the web pages page rank algorithm considers backlink in deciding the rank score these are the popular web structure mining algorithm or link algorithm goals of web mining what are all the goals of web mining the overall goals of web mining might be it improves the system performance enhances the security of system provides the support for marketing design and it facilitates site modification thus web mining is explained thank you